You know, being an adult is sometimes not much fun because you are drenched with responsibilities. But there is one thing that makes it up for all of those downsides, and that is that you get access to the adult money with which you can buy whatever you want. Just like me, who bought this magical power that I no longer need my phone to record videos. How about that? Now the source of this sorcery are these glasses and the name of these glasses are Ray-Ban Wayfair from Meta. Let's talk about them. Now I remember that being a child whenever I wanted something I would have to ask my parents to buy me that thing because they would have the access to the money and they would make me wait sometimes for months and sometimes for years even because that is what every good parents do. They make their kids wait before they give them whatever they want. But now being an adult and having the access to the adult money, I can buy whatever I want, whenever I want. Okay, let me correction that. If you are married, then you still need to ask from your wife before you purchase those stupid items. Just like this one. On which I wasted almost $350 because that's what they are worth. And the reason I told you that you have to ask your wife is because I forgot to ask my wife. Hey, I just saw another charge on the card. Did you buy another pair of sunglasses or something? No, why would happen? I'm seeing a charge for Ray Bans or something. I might have. What do you mean you might have? Why would you buy another pair? You just bought a pair last week. These ones have can buy in them. You know what? You're sleeping on the couch tonight, that's all. Alright? Can I still keep the glasses? You should be asking me if you can still keep your place in bed. Anyways, all jokes apart, Facebook launched their smart glasses for the very first time two years ago, which they called Ray-Ban Stories, and now recently they launched it again and rebranded as Ray-Ban Wayfair. I have been eyeing these glasses since the day they came out, but I was never sure before to purchase them because the technology was still new until this release where Facebook upgraded the camera quality, the audio quality, increased the battery life, and made it much more easier to charge and made it look a little better. Aren't they cool? Now a lot of those features that I have told you about these glasses are only on the paper and I actually don't know yet that these glasses are worth it to me or not. That is the reason for the time being I'm calling it a stupid purchase. But let's take these glasses out, do a few chores of my daily activity life and figure out that how much these glasses are usable in your day to day activities. Hey Meta, start the video. Now the first task that we will be doing for the day is that to go grab some coffee though it's 4.15 right now and it's a little bit late for a coffee but I do need coffee as I have to do some work later on in the day but while we're going to grab our coffee let's talk and test a little bit of these glasses. While playing with these glasses the very first thing that I realized is that these glasses are not meant for vertical videos and are only meant for horizontal videos. The reason is because if you will focus on the frame for your uh, vertical video, it will just crop out the video and give you a shitty result. So off the bat, that is a very negative point from me towards these glasses because if I want a glasses with a camera, I want that glasses to have capability to record horizontal as well as vertical. Not only one way. After that, the camera quality is in front of you as on one side of the screen, you can see the Sony ZV-1 footage and on the other, you can see the footage of these glasses. They ain't that bad as you can clearly see that the colors that they are differentiating and the smoothness in these glasses are way better than many action cameras out there. So that's a plus point. The next thing that we need to talk about are the microphones that are in these glasses. According to Facebook, according to Meta, there are five microphones in built in these glasses that record your voice as well as they record the voice of the person in front of you you are talking to. And we need to put this on the test right now that how clear does these microphones and this DJI for the Sony Sony ZV capture. Hey, uh, can I have an ice latte? Okay. Um, I'll take a large. Yeah, anything else today? How much sugar will in that be? 
bumps of liquid sugar? So there's actually no liquid sugar in um, like a standardized latte, but we can add any flavor you'd like. I'll take the pumpkin one. So it comes with six pumps usually. Is that okay? Do you want less more? I think I'll just take the two pumps. Two pumps, okay. And um, do you want whipped cream on it or? No, that's it. I'll see you up here then, thank you. Thank you. Six pumps of flavor? <laughs> that is the reason people in US are so obese. Six pumps? <sighs> that would be disgusting. Hello. Here we go. Thank you. You too. So that was the mics and the voice. Oh, why did I open this? Voice quality of these glasses and the Sony ZV-1's microphone. Let me know in the comment section which one is better because I have really no idea. Once I'll sit on the editing, that's when I'll know. But for the timing, you can let me know in the comment section. And let's see how much the two pumps of this ice pumpkin is. Oh, it's still sweet. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Wow. And they said that a normal flavor comes with six pumps of li this liquid flavor or liquid sugar. No wonder why Americans are so obese. Let me know in the comment section if you would want to see me making a video where I'll show you what Americans eat and how much sugar and how much cheese is in normal everyday food of America. Okay, there's also one more thing that I have been noticing again and again is that the video will stop recording itself after 60 seconds and uh, we'll have to restart the video from here by holding this button after every 60 seconds. Why Meta, why? You make things so difficult. Talking about another drawback of these glasses is that Meta has not given the access to view what I am viewing right now. The only way I can see what I have been recording this frame is either I record it and then download it and then view it or I go and do Instagram or Facebook live for which these glasses are actually built for. Again, that doesn't make sense at all. Meta should have at least given us access to view what the actual frame is at the moment. Anyways, now moving on to our next task for the day is the cleaning of this car. My car looks like shit from inside. So let's go clean the car and see how the glasses are actually acting and moving while I am moving all around doing my daily activity. This is still sweet. Ooh, okay. Outside is done. Let's go park the car over there and do the inside. Ooh. This is a new Mustang, all electric. New? Yeah, all electric. Yeah, no more gas anymore. No Espanol? Uh, no Espanol. Wow, it's huge. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, that's a big screen. Yeah. That was nice. That was nice. Thanks, man. Wow, Yeah. Rapido. Oh, yes, it's a Mustang. It is wow. fast. Yep. Hi ma'am. Hi Mr. Spy. What's up? I'm testing my new glasses. Oh, Aww. Aww, baby sleeping? Yeah, just laying Okay. You can keep playing. I go up and keep playing. For your gym? I'll have to admit that wearing these glasses all day long gave me a little headache. Now, I don't know why is that. So is that the new frame, the thicker frame that I'm not used to or some kind of electromagnetic, superhuman natural powers in it that is giving me headaches right over here. Uh, anyways, they still look cool and we'll keep using them. And now is the time to test the last feature of these glasses. The kind of feature that these glasses are actually built for that is going live on Facebook and Instagram. Let's test that now.
Now, because these glasses are made by Meta, you can only go live either on Facebook or on Instagram. And the process of going live is super easy. All you need to do is pick up your phone and either open Facebook or Instagram. For me, let's say it is Instagram. And what we'll do is we'll just start a live session. Again, to switch back to the camera of Instagram, all I need to do is double click and it will shift. And this is how easy it is with these glasses on this platform. And that's pretty much everything about these glasses. Glasses. I hope this video will help you decide whether you want these glasses or not and if this is a worth it purchase for you or not for me I think it's a so so not sure yet but all I can say is that it's my adult money and I can waste wherever I want I feel I'm in a move for a switch up I hit the function hit the rose till I hiccup